Today is Friday, November 4th, 2011. And this right here is a, a mock together of a, a little pocket rocket uh, stove. I made together looking at things on the internet. I made mine out of galvanized steel. You should not make yours out of galvanized steel if you make one of these. This is an experiment. It gives off nasty gases that are probably giving me cancer just breathing them. But uh, looking down here, you can see the flames going, but most of the flames, some of them are jumping up. The feed tube might be a little big or something, but most of the flames are going horizontally into the uh, into the can. And you can see here, I'm holding this paper towel above the top of the feed tube here. You know, it's just fine. It's a paper towel. But at the exhaust at the top, I hold this paper towel up there. And you can see the sides are instantly turning black. Actually, you might not be able to see it because of the, the, the sun. But uh, if I held it up here, this, I mean, of course this thing gets charred first, but uh, it, will, it will ignite. It will ignite if I keep it up there. Just from the, uh, just from the, ow, ow, it's hot. Okay, just from the, but you can see this isn't just, this this isn't just soot and ash accumulating on it. You can see it's actually getting burned just from the heat coming off of that thing. It's putting out a ridiculous amount of heat, especially since we're just lighting it off of twigs. I mean, this right here, this is at least twice the size of anything that I fed into that thing, and I'm using that as a poker stick. But no, it's, it, uh, it gives off some, some, some crazy heat. Uh, if you were to put some cob around that uh, that vent post and, and collect that heat as it's coming out and let it uh, dissipate throughout the night, then uh, like a, like a real rocket stove, the kind where you know you go down, you know, put the feed in there and that goes through a bench or something, I can see how that's that that puts out some some awesome heat. But yeah, this is this is just me being a pyromaniac and uh, enjoying some fire. So uh, yeah, that's it. Thanks.